Okay, I want to show you guys this outfit and I want to know what you think. <laughs> oh my god, it looks so terrible. Okay, what do, I don't know if you can see anything, my boobs or whatever, but whatever, okay. Do we like this or do we hate it? Like, I don't, you guys know I told you I don't know how to dress anymore. This is like so new for me. I feel like it looks really good like that. Right? Does it? I mean, obviously I'm going to put a jacket on, but I don't know. I love this. Like, I would have never been able to wear a tight shirt like this before. Oh my God. Like, oh no. Like, would not have been cute. Um, I don't know. My body's just so different now. Like, now I can wear like, baggy pants and tight shirts. Before it was the opposite. It was like tight baggy tops and tight pants. I don't know. It's like just completely different body, but... Do we like this or is this not me? Problem is, I know I shouldn't be wearing bodysuits because I have a very short waist. Um, I know it does; it's not like super flattering, but do we like this? I feel like this is okay for some reason. Looks like a jacket over. I just don't know what kind of jacket to get. I don't want to get like the matching Adidas jacket because I feel like it's a little bit like extra. But I feel very like on with this like that. I don't know. What do we think? Oh, this is from Urban Outfitters and I got these from there too, just so you guys know. I don't know if everyone's gonna ask. But then I feel like when I go like that, it looks bad. It needs to stay like that. I don't know, like down in the front and tie on the sides. What do we think? I don't I don't know, I don't know. Oh my god, I don't know. Oh my god, this is like so weird for me. Is this not okay? I can't tell. Um, okay, what am I doing? I'm just gonna do like very simple makeup today. And I just figured I would have you guys see. I haven't done a vlog in like forever. You guys know that I've been like so busy with everything. Ugh. I don't know. Okay. I'm not used to my body. I'm used to like having no boobs. But I actually like really love it. I feel like my boobs have completely evened me out. Like I was missing. Like my body was like missing anatomy. I swear to God. Like now that I like put clothes on I'm like. What the fuck? Like, no wonder you fit into nothing before. I have shampoo in my ear. Why does it happen? Like, it's so gross. Okay. Um, I'm not going to go over products or anything I'm using because I'm not really, like, doing the most best. The, I'm not doing, like, the best makeup today. Because I always do the best makeup. <laughs> um, I'm just doing, like, some simple things. And I'm just using, like, some sample things that I have anyway. So... I don't really know what they are, so I'm just putting shit on, trying to get ready. Um, today is, wow, that feels really good. <sighs> like, when I sit down, like, I don't have, I mean, yeah, I'm, like, I'm pulling this high, but I don't really have to. I'm just still, like, like, I don't know, my body's different now. Um, okay. So, yeah, you guys know I've just been so busy with this. I'll catch you up on the uh, Privé. So you guys know I launched my Privé line, which is my my new de ring designs. Um, my battery pack is dying, so this might cut me out. But uh, my ring designs, I'm wearing the um, HRH chain and the rose gold, and I'm wearing the uh, rose gold pink kind of signet ring. And um, the line did so well, you guys. It's pretty much everything sold out on the first day and then after that um everything now is a pre-order option so they'll be ready to get to you in two weeks and i've already explained that so i'm sure a lot of you guys know but don't um be afraid to order even though it's a pre-order because that means you're just getting you know what i mean like you'll be first in line and then you'll be secured for what you order as well um so i really want to honest to god like I just, more than, I can't explain it. Like, I didn't even care about the sales, honestly. What I cared about the most is knowing that you guys really liked the line. I was so concerned because it was the first time that I actually had drawn things out from my head rather than just, you know, t um, creating things with chains and crystals and pearls and things like that. This is, like, something that I was, like, a real kind of, like, thoughts that I was like, hey, I want to make, you know what I mean? Like things I drew out and I was like, this is a big move and it's really different from what I've ever done. And I hope everyone loves it. I just wanted, I don't know. I just wanted to, I don't know. I was really nervous. I was really nervous. I'm like, because in the past, every, you guys, you guys love what I, you guys love what I create. And I just, that is what makes me the happiest is like 
knowing you guys love it and knowing you guys want it, want it for yourself. Like that's what it is. I like am so flattered that you guys want to wear what I create. And this was something I really, really like created even more than before because I drew out everything. And um, I don't know. I was just really happy. I'm really, really happy that you guys love it. Like I'm really happy and I already have plans for more things. And so we're working on that <laughs> now. But um, yeah, I wanted to catch you up on that. Don't be afraid to do the pre-order option because that just means you're going to be getting your rings sooner. You know what I mean? Because there's like gonna be a, there's, I feel like there's gonna be a line for these. This is a small production, you guys. This is not like a huge. It's a production. It's a very. I have a small line. It's like a big line where I can produce like thousands and thousands of pieces. You know, um, well, you know, like five thousands of each one. Like that's really hard. So, anyway, I hope you understand. But I don't know. You guys know. I haven't vlogged a long time, so I feel like rusty with talking to you guys. And everything I'm using today, I'm not told you I'm not talking about it, but everything I'm using, it's not like new, so um, you'll like know. You'll be like, oh yeah, I used that before. In case you're like interested in something I'm using, I promise it's nothing new. I've already like shared it with you guys. Um, I have nothing like. Ooh, oh my god, can we please talk about how awful my eyebrows are right now? Um, I have nothing like new to like discuss. Like I have no like I don't have any beef right now. Except for it's my birthday coming up. My birthday's on May 13th. And I have no like real plans. I'm not that like you guys know I don't have a like a lot of friends or anything. I don't even like to really do anything. Um I just gonna like, go out with my I think my um Judy and Sky, you guys know my colleagues. I don't like to say you guys know I always say, but I don't like to say the word assistants. I think it's just like a little bit like who the fuck do you think you are thing. Like, oh, my assistants. Cause like, I just don't like that. You know what I mean? Because I don't feel like we work like that. We all work together. So, um, it just sounds weird to me. Like, oh, oh that's really hot. Like, that's really attractive, Alex. Um, so anyway, I think I'll be going out with them one night, one day this week. And, um... As always, I shouldn't. I don't know if I should, I, should, I should be saying this, but please, like you guys know, every year for my birthday, I do do a um, a big like gift for you guys too, like something really nice, and I just like it's a way to celebrate because you guys are my friends too, and honestly, I think you guys are like really my friends. <laughs> like, isn't that weird? So I always like to do whatever I can um, to give something to you too as a gift. So um, stay tuned for that. Probably I'm hoping to introduce what that gift is on Thursday. So watch out for that because it's going to be a real cool thing. I'm just going to leave it at that. Um, but today is... I'm going to take you guys with me somewhere today. I guess that's fine. Whatever. I like Alex, it's not a big deal. Um, I'm going to take you guys somewhere today. And I don't have to tell you now or later. <laughs> it's really stupid. But I've been waiting to go because I wanted to go with you guys. Don't we love the periwinkle with this like orangey red lipstick? I kind of don't even want to wear any makeup. What do we think? Should I put on like some black, some mascara? Oh my god, I got this mascara. Of course I did. It's AB like um, lights, camera, flashes one. But lights, camera, lash, lights, camera, lashes. But I did, honestly don't like it. I just like the packaging. And I didn't. What I wanted the the Givenchy one, but they didn't have it at that Sephora. So I just picked this out. Also, oh yeah, I'm do, been doing styling my hair differently now. You guys, I am so over the like beachy waves thing that everyone does. Like I don't even know. I just hate it. I hate straight hair. I hate beachy waves. So I've been trying to do like almost like an old Hollywood looking like vibe on my hair. And I'll kind of show you what I mean by that. I just kind of like took inspiration, I guess, from like the movies, like old movies and kind of like did it to my hair. 
because I think that this, this beachy wave thing is so tired. I cannot stand it anymore. Like that's all everyone does now is like this beachy wave. And I don't know how to do that really like soft voluminous curl, like the one that doesn't look like a curl, looks like a wave, like a Veronica Lake looking wave. I really want to do that, but I just don't know how to do that. But this be beachy wave thing needs to fucking die. And also what needs to die is a fucking highlight thing that like, the beachy highlight. I'm so over it. Like, I'm so over it. I don't, I just put me back blonde. Like, like just put me back blonde. You know what I mean? Like, it just does never turns out the way, like, it should. So, just, like, let me just be normal. So, that's what I'm doing now. I don't think I'm going to do, um, on the bottom lashes. Yeah, I am. That's stupid. hate this fucking mascara i really do it's horrible it is like cheap i don't like it i really don't like it Ugh. i hate it so bad my god it's like the i honestly only bought it for that package my head differently so i kind of just like blow it out my god my boobs look so big right now because of the fish lens <laughs> okay i'm also tucking everything in and people are telling me not to tuck in but like i just kind of want to because i've never been able to before whatever i'm fine right now then okay um so what i've been doing is um blowing in my ends as much as i can and then i've been taking different sections like this and i call it like okay it is totally like doll hair like um doll hair or like princess hair i feel like it's so princess like disney princess looking hair i don't know what it is and i just do that and i let the ends sit like this okay and then in the end and then afterwards i'm going to brush it out wait do i do it now i forgot i haven't done it in a couple days so i forget yeah like that Okay, then don't worry, I'll blow, I'll blow dry it out afterwards, but I do them in like just different sections. And I saw like, I think it was on Instagram, like a, a picture, it was very like, what was it called? It was, I think it was a wig actually, it was like a really blonde looking wig. And it looked like this, and I was like, I could do that now that I have all blonde hair and that like beachy wave thing going on. I don't know, I just want this beachy wave fucking thing to end. I just like solid color hair now. I don't like beachy waves, it's like so lame and basic. Beachy, but be like high highlights and shit. Like everyone's gonna mad at me, and like, I can't say shit around this fucking place. Okay, so that's what it kind of looks like. Like, so cute, right? Ugh, love it. Okay, wait, I'm not done. Don't. Don't kill me yet. I'm not done, but you guys are kind of getting the vibe. Okay, now I'm going to go here. And you have to make sure to get all of these, like, mid-length hairs. Okay, this. Just two sections. I feel like it's very like doll hair princess. Don't hate me. <laughs> you guys are like, what the fuck is this bitch doing? Don't worry, everyone's everyone's me tagging me in their hair, but like, Alex, I did it and I love it. So don't make fun of me yet. You're gonna love it in the end. Okay. I'm, and that's it. I'm kidding. <laughs> what if that was it? Okay. Just let it kind of sit. I'm gonna do the other side too, and then we're gonna blow dry it, like blow it out, so that the curls like kind of like really, you know what I mean? Relax. Ugh, just relax, curl. I don't feel like I'm gonna relax. What the hell is this? I just man, so stupid. Okay, should I tell you guys what I'm doing? We're doing today. What we are doing? If you are following, if you're watching this vlog, this is what we're doing today. 
Okay, Cinco de Mayo, I saw on Facebook, Jack in the Box was like offering free tacos, right? It's like, oh, click here to go to the Jack in the Box page to get two free tacos. If you guys know me, you know I fucking love Jack in the Box 99 cent tacos. They are bomb, okay? They're so fucking good. That's like, there's like one like by the freeway next to my office. So if I have like a really stressful day, I will stop for like two tacos um, and like a fuck ton of hot sauce. I'll get like five hot sauces for each taco. Okay, anyway, that's beside the point. So I was like, okay, cool. I'll fucking take a coupon for free tacos. <laughs> so I go on their website, and of course, it's like with purchase. Like, you know what I mean? Like, with, with like purchase of another meal. Like, I'm not going to buy another meal. Like, it's just me. So unfortunately, I didn't get my free tacos. But um, I saw when I went to their page, they have a new Cinnabon iced latte, you guys. Okay. And I was like, I always love to think of like think treats I can have that aren't a ton of calories. So I was like, oh my God, a Cinnabon flavored iced coffee. Like this sounds fucking bomb. So, um, so I went a little bit higher on this time. Like, like it just, everything is different. It was to like make some higher, some lower. Like how pretty is that? Okay. Um, and then I went on Cinnabon or I went on the Jack in the Box website. And I was looked at the calories on it. I think like the small one was like three something okay so it was a lot but i'm going to and i know it's gonna be way too sweet i'm gonna hate it i already know i'm gonna hate it so this is what I, my plan is i'm going to order the cinnabon la ice latte with extra ice extra ice i'm gonna tell them to fill up the cup with ice so that's already taking away a lot of the calories right doll hair bitches oh my goodness don't we love it it's so cute right i just feel like so adorable <laughs> actually i really love it it's so cute it's like my thing okay um so this is how i'm going to jack the box <laughs> for real this is how i'm fucking going to jack the box okay um i got ready for you guys okay so um oh my ring's on so okay we're jack back to back jack back to jack in the box um oh my gosh i got mascara on this room right mascara episode okay so i went on the jack and box oh, no, so this is what i'm gonna order because i know that for sure it's like this is how i'm gonna cut calories i'm gonna tell them to just put in okay to put a ton of ice in so that already like eliminates out like a third of the calories right like let's be real a third okay and then i'm it's gonna be too sweet even to drink like it's just gonna be too sweet i know for sure so i'm gonna order an iced latte and i'm gonna order the cinnamon latte and i'm gonna do half and half so it'll be like some, some Cinnabon and some uh, regular latte. And then I guess I'm going to trash the other, other, other half, but whatever. Okay, so I just really want to try it with you guys because this might be, new, be my new, like, thing. Um, my new coffee. And I'm just, like, so excited about it. I've been, like, waiting to go with you guys to try this, this latte because it just sounds amazing. Okay, except this is not cute when it flips and it has to stay like that. It's, like, so cute. Right? Like, it's just doll hair. And then, like, toward, it just, like, keeps getting cuter. The Towards the end of the day, look at that. Like, it's just so... This is, like, you know what I mean? You know, like, a, when you were a kid and you went to, like, Target or whatever it was, like, Toys R Us when we were kids? This needs to be straight. Um, and you bought, like, a doll. This is the kind of hair it looked like. It looked the curl at the end, right? That's what I was going for. So this has to be perfect. I hate a messy part. It is so grotesque. There. <gasps> perfect. I'll show you how gross this mascara is. Look at this. It does that black, huge smudge. Look at that. And I just put it on. Like, I know that my eyes are like notorious for doing that, for like making a smudge, but this mascara like literally does it in two minutes. Not even. Like, right when I put it on. Okay, I'm gonna, um, I'm just gonna do my rings with you guys today because I don't know what I'm gonna wear. Okay, what should I wear? I'm trying to think. Um, 
This is like, I, I'm just so excited. This is like so new, new to me too because I haven't been able to, you remember that beeping sound, that fucking ice maker? It's the stupidest thing in the world. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna wear. I think I'm gonna wear, I think I'm gonna wear silver and rose gold today. I think I'm gonna do that, but I might put a pill in here. Remember I told you guys the grand coils, you can um, twirl them together. So you can do this and they, you can keep, it, you can twirl it to the very end like that and it fits perfectly or you can twirl it just to the beginning like where both of the points meet kind of and make like a bigger statement ring. Just kind of depends on what you want to do. Um, I think I might put a pearl with it or a pill with it today. I feel like doing the pill today. The pill cluster is so cute. I'm not sure if I should do a pill cluster today. I kind of don't want to wear this with this next to it. I put this over here in the middle, but I don't have that size for me today. Actually, I don't have that size at all. It goes here. I could just play this all day long, you guys. You know that. Mm hmm. This is the best. this was the most popular, the pill with the ruby heart, and this is the one that I was honestly I was like I was like, are they going to under to like get the pill? Are they gonna like are they gonna like that? Like cause I love the edginess of that, like the quirkiness, like almost like the unorthodoxness of it. Like what's the word? Rudeness? I don't know. It's just a little bit like edgy, like kind of like. Uh, you know what I mean? Like, I mean, it's borderline, like, it's borderline paraphernalia, right? <laughs> like, I don't know. So it was just kind of like a, it was a gamble, I feel like, because I love anything with pills on it. And um, I guess you guys did too, but you love the red one. And I was really, really shocked about that because I don't typically, whenever I do red crystals or something, it just, they don't, I mean, those are definitely not the popular ones, even though the reds that I choose are like, I love the reds that I choose. I think I was gonna keep it simple today. I feel like I feel like I need something here. I could wear the midi. <gasps> Where's my midi? I think I left the midi at the office. The fucking silver midi I left at the office. Fuck. Here's the gold midi. Um, let me think. Maybe I'll wear everything on one hand. I should wear that. Everything on one hand so that it. Because I don't like to wear less than three. This is like very cool, right? I feel like this is super cool. This is rose gold, rose gold chain, silver ground coil, and the rose gold. I'm not gonna say it because I do not know how to say it. Oh my goodness, I'm in the worst fucking trouble for this. Okay. All right, so this is what I'm wearing. And I'll link everything below. This is my look for today. I'm going to put like a sweater on, like a striped sweater, and then we'll go to Jack in the Box. I'll fucking fly as shit. So. <laughs> Do you guys have the Cinnabon latte? We have iced coffee. The Cinnabon flavor? Yes. Okay. Uh, yeah. It's just an iced coffee Cinnabon flavor. Okay. Um, can you do it like a little bit less sweet than normal? Okay, I want one like that and then just one regular iced coffee with no sweetener. It's already pre-made now, so mix the, the iced mocha and the iced coffees are already pre-made with the sweetener. Oh, the iced coffee already has sweetener in it? Yes. Oh, okay, just the Cinnabon then. Okay. With a, the can I have a lot of ice in it? Like, a, okay. a lot of ice. Thank you. Why do they make everything sweet? Like, why does iced coffee sweet too? It's fucking dumb. This is the smallest drive through in here. I'm going to crush my car right now. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Have a good day. Thanks. Can I have another cup full of ice, please? I won't take this up until I tell you guys. Thanks. Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna park now. 
except of course I'm on like a main fucking street. And on this main street they have like pedestrian crossings with no lights. With like no like with no street lights, so it's really easy to run people over. I hate coming here. On fucking Wilsh I'm on Wilshire, I think. What is this? I fucking hate this area. Look like this. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is fucking bomb. This is so fucking good, you guys. I'm not even fucking exaggerating. I cannot tell you how much this fucking Cinnabon coffee tastes like a fucking Cinnabon. It does not even taste like coffee. It is so fucking good, but there is coffee. And I can like taste the coffee too. Okay, it's like when you take the oven, an initial, initial sip, it is like a little bit too cinnamony, but it goes away really quick, and then you get like this creamy, milky cinnamon bun flavor. It is legit amazing. Oh my god, this is my new. Okay, let's look at the calories. I gotta tell you guys calories because this is important. This is really fucking important. Okay. Um. I actually, I actually don't even have a cup holder still. I don't know if you guys know my... Remember the cup holder problem? I still don't have my cup holder fixed. Don't ask. Just don't even ask, okay? Because I'm not going to tell you because it's fucking ridiculous. Okay. Jack in the Box food. Let's see where we go. I was on the page earlier to find out where there was a location because I was like, actually, where the fuck? The only one I know is like downtown. Um, okay. Shakes and desserts. Drinks. Drinks. Okay. Cinnabon iced coffee. Oh, fuck. Is this just better be like officially on their website? This better be like officially at their restaurant like for good not like just like a limited time thing okay nutrition info serving size regular okay calories 225 calories that's not that bad and I'm not gonna drink this whole thing I will probably drink half that is such a good treat you guys run out to Jack in the Box you need to fucking run I suggest getting a lot of ice because I hate like when I'm drinking this and there's like no ice it's like nails on a chalkboard like this is slightly nails on a chalkboard for me like I should be able to see the ice all the way down here and I don't see any ice down here like it makes me sick Bang. this is really good iced coffee it's so good except do we believe her do we believe that bitch that it is like all pre-made because how come there's a line of cinnamon at the bottom here I don't know if I believe her I feel like she, but I do because why would she lie? But like, I feel like then why is there like a, it looks like she squirted something at the bottom of the cup. You know what I mean? Hey, so today we are shipping out the first orders from the HRH Privé line. And so excited. Here's some of them, whoops. And then the other one's over there. But I wanted to show you guys like the little packaging, everything comes in. Um, yeah, so I've shown you guys this before. It's just a, like a coated kind of, really soft, shiny, white pull box. It's a little jewelry box with mirrored HRH and then, I don't know if you can see, but like this, my logo, or my shop name on the side. And then you're gonna get little individual ring bags like this for each one of your rings. And they're little canvas bags. So they're not like that, you know that tacky, like hard velvet. I really did not want that, I hate that. And then the coating on this it's like a wax coating on the string which is really nice I love that I don't know like this stuff is very important to me so every bag every ring here is the grand coil gets one bag and so there's a little so if this order was like this I put both the little bags inside the box so cute and then like that oops so cute right guys so that's what we're doing today we're packing the first orders um, to go out and every not everything most of these most of the sizes and designs sold out on the first day you guys probably noticed that a lot of the things towards the end of the day were at pre-order or not even available to order so what that means is basically 
the stock ran out on the first day. So thank you guys so much. It was such a good turnout. You're going to absolutely love these rings. I'll show them to you later too, the individual ones again. But I have five rings in this collection and you can get them in gold and silver and then some of them in rose gold. And a lot of you guys love them. They're really, really cool and unique. And I think that obviously showed through because most of it sold. It, I, I don't wanna say all of it sold out, but there's like a select, you know, some sizes that are left, so I don't know if I should say that. Um, so now everything is available for pre-order. Most things are available for pre-order. And that means that you're going to be getting, if you order, place your order now for them, you'll be getting the rings in two to three weeks. And everything is done in, like, hand done in really small batches. So it's not like um, a process I want to rush because I really care about the way these turn out. Everything is done really, really nicely, plated really nicely, has a really great coating on it, and textured, and it's all shiny and really pretty, and all the stones are set hand by hand. So anyway, that's what we're doing today. We're just packing everything, and I wanted to kind of show you guys. But yeah, I'll show you guys the line too. I just feel like it's very, very bright right here. Like when I show this, for example, I feel like it's all blown out. Can you see this? I don't even know. I don't think you can. This is my pill with AB. I have to go in a darker. I'm like standing right next to the light, so maybe that's the reason. Let me see. Can you see it here? Yeah, I think it's here better. It's too blown out this way, isn't it? Ugh, I want to sit down with you guys and show you. Anyway. the hearts themselves. This one goes together. Okay. No, oh, it's so cool. Can you see it? Isn't that cool? It's so pretty. I love it. But we, the little pink one, that one's a lot bigger. And then we have, um, we have it like not, when I first got the pink one, I got it like a long time ago and I still lived like in my loft downtown. And they, she, like the lady who did it, who I bought it from, she asked me, are you leaving? Judy hates talking. <laughs> Can I show them? I won't show them you. <laughs> so we put the pink one in here. It's more suitable for like, this is like the workroom area and this is like, I don't wanna show everyone cause it's like very private. <laughs> but this is like the more like classy area. So um, it's not ready yet, but all right. Judy wants to talk to me. Judy doesn't like to talk when I'm, when I'm in my room video, so I have to go. <laughs> I'm gonna get in trouble, <laughs> bye.